it is going to be one of those evenings. He even had a, uh, you swallowed the whole torch? Yeah, he had a spray tan, especially so they don't show up in the moonlight. Do you have them whitened when you were in Mexico? King. No, I didn't. <laughs> Was it, were you a, uh, one of those like cosmetic surgery tourists? No, I wasn't I a cosmetic surgery. No. no, you just had your teeth whitened. No, I just had my teeth whitened. Yeah. You need liposuction. <laughs> <laughs> We've already suggested that the Mitsubishi Outlander PHEV could appeal to the shooting market because of its 4x4 stealth, but tonight we're going to try and see if we can win over the likes of Crow, because he might harbour the odd doubt. What do you reckon of the vehicle? Yeah, it's nice. Yeah. It's nice. Yeah, it's, it's good. I haven't been in it yet. No, I'm just saying, like visually, what do you think of it? Yeah, it looks nice. Yeah? Yeah, I wish I put one for the missus. Mm. Yeah, I wouldn't have got an electric one, would I? Why? Bloody battery goes flat after 30 miles. And you have to walk home. Cut. Do you reckon we'll convert you then to electric power tonight? I was impressed the way you jutted off out the. Jutted? <laughs> jutted off out the. <laughs> you, like, you like the fact that I was nearly able to run over Baby Crow because he couldn't hear it coming. Yeah. He, had, he had his earphones on, didn't he? He did, yeah. Yeah, he's quiet. No, he's quite impressive. So you're going to shoot some bodies, isn't it? Yeah, just loss them in the back. So we've got leather seats. Please. Oh, well, I'll check with Davey. He says, not my car, do we want? Is that what he said? Yeah. So, making sure Baby Crow is nowhere around, we head off, hoping to catch the bunnies unaware. Crow is using his faithful Anschutz 17HMR this evening, and very soon the red beam of lamp finds the bunnies. It's tough to gauge whether the rabbits are being caught napping, but Andy's put thousands of them in the back of his buggy over the years. He should be able to give us an educated guess. What we find with the rabbits after a while, they get to... I hear the buggy coming, I hear the um, quad bites coming, and... Uh, they're on their toes and away. But with this, we found off why. Notice that the rabbits tend to sit there. I'd have to take the windscreen out and um, <laughs> I need to put someone, I need someone from the arm to rest. More rabbits fall, and with the battery spent and the petrol engine breaking the near silence, we head home for a debrief. Right, first question, Andy. Yes. You were a bit skeptical when we set out. Yeah, I was. About the electric vehicle. Yeah, I was. What do you reckon of it? Um, honestly. Honestly. I thought it was brilliant. Uh, the only letdown was when the battery went flat, was when the engine started up, it sounded a bit noisy. Because <laughs> it had been quiet for so long, but no, it was. I was impressed with it. I mean, we, we only had a, a short charge on that. We only yeah, had a few right. miles because we've been, been cocking about taking yeah. pictures of it earlier. But yeah. if you have a fully charged battery, yeah. I think you'd get round a, a decent night's rabbiting, wouldn't you? Yeah, definitely. So uh, that was a good bit of fun out with uh, with Crowman tonight. I was really excited to try this bit of kit. It's the first, I say, the first uh, hybrid that's that's really appealed to me uh, as a shooter as well as a, a motoring enthusiast. We tried to get stuck a few times, but you did, yeah. But it did okay, didn't it? Yeah, it did. So yeah. yeah, if this is the future, it's not all bad. Not bad for us, but possibly a pain in the tailpipe for the rabbits.